Sophie, I didn't know what to do. You were gone. What did you expect? I was broke. There was nothing else we could do. They took our castle and a friend introduced me to Savannah. She said she'd help me out and give me a place to stay, but for something in return. I'd agree to it before she said that little Kelly or little Carly have to marry her son. Don't try to pin this on me, Tom. A simple phone call was all that was needed to get me home. How could you have done this to me? To us? To your daughters as well. The poor innocent girls have no idea what you have signed up for. I really don't like Savannah or that son of hers. What are we going to do? We have to do something about Savannah and her son quick. Sophie, you need to calm down. I'll come up with something. I just need some time to think. We can't keep fighting like this all the time. Remember what we used to be. I'll take care of everything with this evil prince and queen Savannah. I need you to stay here with me and the girls, though, while I put a plan in place. I don't know whether I can trust you anymore, Tom. Once I leave, you go running into another woman's arms. You don't want to pick up the phone and try to sort things out with me. The only reason you want me now is because you've messed up so bad with everything here. I do remember what we used to be, but I don't know if we'll ever be there again. Only for our daughters, Tom. Only for our daughters. I'm so sorry, Sophie. I... I'm sorry. Gosh, little Cody, can you hear them fighting up there like cats and dogs? I know, I hate when they're fighting, but they always seem to be fighting these days. I just want to help them. I know, and we got all the decorations up again because we wanted to make them happy, but it seems like they're still just fighting away. I don't know what to do. Yeah, I know. Well, you know what? Maybe we could do something nice to try and fix the problem, you know? But what could we do? Hmm, I don't know. I don't think we should talk about it here because they're still up there. I think they are anyway. Let's, let's have a little look. Um, Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, they're still there. Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh, gosh. Okay. okay. Well, look. Let's go down to our rooms, grab our phones, and, you know, grab some of the money that we saved up and leave for the city. Maybe we could buy them something nice. That's... <gasps> You know what? That's a great idea. Maybe if we buy them the best Christmas present ever, they'll forget about all their problems, and then they'll just be stop fighting and be happy. Mm, gosh, I have a good bit of money saved up. Okay, I'm gonna go check my room and see what I've got. I'm pretty sure I've been saving for coming up to Christmas, mm -hmm. but... Where did I leave my phone? I put it on the shelf. Oh, it's up here. Great. Okay, let me see, let me see. Um, it's there. No. Oh, there's all my money. Oh my gosh, there's so much here. I must have been saving all my little dollars. I'm stuck on a Christmas tree or something. Can't get out of here. It's a snowman. Okay. <laughs> okay. You stuck on a snowman? Where's my phone? I can't find my phone. They should but, be on the shelf, maybe. My mods. Uh, the shelf, the shelf, the shelf. Uh, no, but once you have your phone, I think I'll be okay. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you're right. Ooh, got it. Okay, yeah. I've got all the money on my phone, so let's go and find a really good present for Ooh, Mom and Dad. Maybe we'll go buy them a trip away, but I doubt they want a trip away if they're fighting all the time. Well, maybe, you know what, it could bring them together and it may make them stop fighting. But we'll have a little think through when we're in the city and we can see all the stores. But let's get out of here. Okay, come on. <laughs> Okay, well, I can't think on an empty stomach. Maybe we should go into Red Rocket and get some food before we go shopping. Okay, that sounds like a great idea. Uh, you go get us to see, and I'll just go and get us some hamburgers and some chips. Okay, you what? Oh, you want to sit? Okay, we'll sit down and we'll have a chat about it. Um, is there any free seats? Okay, yeah, there's one over here. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. Where? Uh, uh, uh over to your right, over here. Oh, yeah, okay, come on. Let's talk about it. Maybe we could get them, like, a pony. Um, a pony? But what if they, like... They don't want to play with it, and then they just leave it, and then it'll be up to us to look after it. Um, that's I wouldn't mind a pony, but, like, I just don't know if it's a great present to bring them together. Maybe if we, I mean, we could get them, what's their favorite, what's their song? Maybe we go into the music store and, like, buy the CD. Mm, I don't even know where their song, what their song is. Yeah, um, yeah. Why don't we go to the antique store and find something old that they might like? Ooh, that's a good idea. Okay, come on. Um, okay, thanks for the burgers and the fries. Thank you. Okay, it's the antique, the antique store is run by the bank. Yeah, it is. It's up in that middle part, I think. But I think we'll definitely find a present in the city just because there's so many stores here now. So many, I know. And I love the way it's all up and coming. 
Oh, yeah, it's great. It's small local businesses doing great. Okay, uh, I think it might be this way, Curly. Okay, come on. Let's go um, down and get some watches. Okay, uh, well, fancy dress store. No, that won't be good. I mean, if they dressed up as something, I don't think that will make them fall in love again. No, well, they won't want anything in the butchers unless Mom wants to get a big piece of beef and hit that over the head with it. They're too old for toys, and I don't think a shovel will work either, because, you know, again, someone might hit each other over the head with it. Yeah. I think it might be up here. Yeah, the antique oh. store is up here. Okay, cool. Well, what can we get? Maybe a clock or something? Get their names engraved? Ooh, maybe. Okay, the cameras are pretty cool, but what about... Ooh, a phonograph. They could play, like, their old records on it. Oh, we could get a phonograph. That sounds good. And um, what about a jukebox? Ooh, that could be good either. You know what? Maybe we should talk to the guy behind the counter and see if he knows of any special gift we could get mom and dad. Yeah, you go on. You ask him. Okay, hello there, sir. This is, uh, my name is Lil Kelly and this is Lil Carly. And we're looking to get our parents a really special gift for Christmas. Do you know anything that might work? Mmm, a special Christmas present, eh? You guys check out any of our cool books or our vintage cameras? I don't really know. I suppose you girls would know more about your parents than I do. Sorry I can't be of any more help. I don't know, little Cardi. Maybe he's right. We don't really know what they'd like in this store. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, let's get them a McDonald's voucher. Oh, uh, I don't think they like McDonald's as much as us. Maybe in the music store, maybe their favorite DVD or game or something. Mm, I don't really think they're big gamers, but okay, come on. Let's go give it a or, go. Oh, yeah. Maybe uh, some Michael Buble. Everyone loves a bit of Michael Buble. Everybody does love a bit of Michael Buble. Okay, come on. Where is... Oh, it's up here. Get up this way, the Revolution Music Store. Hopefully they have something, maybe like a Christmas album. Oh, oh, how exciting. Okay, come on, let's come on in and see. Maybe, like, music can bring them back together. Yes, I like this one. Okay, um, let's see. Well, they have lots of guitars and old records, mm -hmm. but... Maybe oh. a nice piano, a keyboard. Um, well, the, unless they're playing it together, I don't know, or Dad serenades Mom or vice versa. Mm -hmm. I'm not too sure. Just some personal love. Maybe we can go and get them a scent that they can, you know, wear the, the scent th together and still smell like each other. <laughs> That's a weird one, but let's do. Let's try. Maybe there, yeah. Maybe there is a unisex uh, perfume that we could get them so they can be matching. Okay, yeah. Uh, let's ooh, see. They all look pretty feminine. Yeah, no, there doesn't seem to be any boys aftershaves or anything. They're all really pink and stuff. Okay, well, this is a dead end. I'm running out of ideas here. Oh, me too. You know what? Well, let's just go to the marketplace, grab a coffee, because we need a little boost to think. Yeah, that's a really good idea. A bit of caffeine, and we should figure this out. Okay, come on, let's go. Mm, these, this coffee is lovely. Oh, I'm gonna grab a hot chocolate. Mm, yum, 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 in my tum tum. So nice. Okay, well, look. Oh, well, I'm all out of ideas. What are we thinking? Um, I don't know. Like I said, the fancy dress shop won't work. The butchers. <gasps> Wait. I know you said that a trip wouldn't work, but maybe it would be the perfect thing for mom and dad, you know? Alone time away from all the problems in the castles and away from Savannah and Lucius. Maybe. Okay, well, come on. Let's go in and see if we can, you know, book something. Do you think that we should send them somewhere warm because it's so cold? Or what do you think? Oh, well, anywhere, but we just need to get them away. So maybe... Hello there. We're just going to go in and talk to one of your travel agents about a trip. Oh, uh, there we go. Okay. Hello there. My name's Little Carly. Um... This is a little Kelly. Hello, ladies. How are you getting on and what can I do to help you today? Well, you see, um, we'd like to book a breakaway for our parents for Christmas. So that's two people, maybe for how long do you think, little Carly? Um, seven nights, maybe. And, you know, in the most romantic place in the world. It's a Christmas present, you know? Okay, okay. Let me see what I can do for you here now. If you just give me one second and I'll have a quick look. Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, got it. Perfect. I have the Four Seasons Hotel for seven nights in Maui. It's an island off Hawaii. Beautiful, romantic, relaxing. Just the perfect place for a couple. What do you girls think? Oh, perfect. That sounds great. How much is it? And can we book it today? Yes, of course you can book that today. No problem. It's going to be $2,000 all in. I can take cash or card. Oh, that's fantastic. We will pay in cash. Uh, I think we've got enough here. Let's see. Uh, there you go. Uh, Plenty. That should, that should be 2000 I think. Thank you very much, ladies. If you just wait here and I'll go print it all out at the reception. OK, 
Okay, I even wrapped it in our special Christmas box on the house, of course. Here you go, ladies, and thank you very much for bucking through us. I hope you have a lovely Christmas. Okay, bye! Oh, very nice. Thank you so much. He's been so helpful. So helpful, goodbye, and merry, merry, merry Christmas. Come on, little Kelly, let's head home and place this present under the tree. Well, no, we can't put it under the tree, little Curly. We're gonna have to hide it somewhere. What if Mom or Dad see it before the time comes to give it to them? Or what if Savannah or Lucia see it? Mm, oh, you're right. Okay, that's great. Well, where are we gonna hide it? Well, look, we'll figure something out, but let's just head home. Okay, come on. saying we have to hide the present somewhere. Yes. I installed a secret safe in the attic, so maybe we could hide it in there. Ooh. Like up on the roof? No, I'll show you. Come on, but don't, we need to go down to my room first so we can get something. I'm turning into quite the master spy. Mm, okay, if you say so. I mean, this all seems a little bit crazy. Mm, okay. But, I mean, we have to be careful because it is. We spent all of our money on this little cardie, so we need to be so careful with it. I don't want people to steal it. Okay, uh, just grab this. All right, you take the camera. Okay, I got it. All right, Why do on. we need a camera? Uh, oh, you picked it up. Never mind. Oh, okay. Now, I'll show you. Follow me. Okay, okay. We have to I'll, be I'll sneaky, though. Okay, okay. Mm. All the way up here. Um, okay, I, I, I lied to you. It is on the roof. I just didn't want to keep it away. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. okay. This is all a little bit suspicious. Can we get out there from up here, or do we have to go from the outside? How do we get upstairs again? I think we have to go from maybe... If we're going to the roof, I would probably say it's from the outside. Probably in the gardens, maybe? Let me think. Mm, um, well, I did build it the other way up, but that looks like that area was blocked off. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay, well, look, maybe we just need to try and make our way up to the roof in whatever way we can and put it into this secret safe and install the camera. And then we can keep an eye and make sure no one is going near our presence. Okay, come on. <sighs> just up here, come on. Okay, okay. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Now, uh, I'm going to place the present in here and then I think you need to pour over this way. Yeah, I'll put a camera to spy mm -hmm. on uh, what's going on. So maybe, um, let me see, where would it be? Go to about, about up here, maybe? Yeah, place it there, place it there. Right. Okay. Come on. Let's get uh, out of the cold. I know why you left a secret safe up here. You wanted Santa put to put extra presents when he comes. Well, he normally does it every year. I just don't tell you about it. What? Oh my no, gosh. <laughs> no, it's not fair. I know. I'm his favorite. I'm, I didn't want to tell you that. Oh, come on. Well, be careful jumping down because uh, we can't go down the ladder in case we're being watched again. Okay, jump and... on the tree, on the tree, on the tree. Okay, okay. Let's see if we can land on top of the Christmas tree. This will be great. Woo! Oh, oh we made it. it. Yeah, well, we made it. That was pretty cool. Come on. Let's go back to our bedrooms and watch some Legally Blonde. Okay, yeah, but we should keep an eye on the camera footage to make sure no one's going up there. Oh, yeah, great idea. <laughs> Thanks for the present, girls. Oh, I wonder what's inside. I better not open it yet until nobody's around. I'll just hide it in my wardrobe. Oh, little Curly, I'm so angry at Lucius. He already stole the present. I mean, we were only started watching Legally... It's gone. What are we going to oh, do? I don't know. I can't believe this. I mean, we didn't even get to see Legally Blonde, and he's just so angry. Oh, we have to prank him. We need to take the present back and prank him. Okay, well, you know what? I did fill a snow chest downstairs full of snowballs. Do we want to go get the snowballs and then hit him with him and take the present back? Uh, maybe we could fill his room with snow while he's not there. And he'll come back and everything will be all melted and horrible. And then, oh, whoa, uh, made it. Oh, gosh. And we can get all the snowballs and we can throw them at them as well. But we need to take the present back. I wonder where he hid it in his room. Mm, I know. Okay, let's go into the kitchen and get some snow. I can't believe he's done this, you know. What if he goes to Hawaii without us? Uh, I know. That would be so annoying. Wait, okay, into the kitchen. Gosh, I'm getting so confused with everything. In the okay, here kitchen. we go. Yeah, here I put the snow. See, there's oh. loads of snow down here. So you take some and then we can go up and put it all in his room. I wonder if he's gone. Okay, we need to make sure he's not in the room. Okay, let's see. Um, no, he's not here. No, okay, present. Let's... Mm. present, present, where are you, present? Oh, look, 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 just fill the room full <gasps> of snow. I got it, I got it, I found it. You got it? 
Yeah, I got the present, okay? Now we just need to put all the snow everywhere and it will melt and his carpets will be soaked and it will be freezing in here. Yeah, cool. I can't believe that he was trying to steal our present to our parents. You know what? I think he wants mom and dad to be fighting. Uh, probably because he wants his the dad to be with his mom. But that's so creepy. I'm never marrying this dude. No, never, ever, ever. Oh, gosh. Okay, just keep going. Okay, I think that's enough. Should we get out of here? I think I can hear him coming. Ah, get out, get out, get out, get out. Ah, what's going on? Why is the snow all over my room? Ah, someone is going to pay. 